friends, it's another beautiful morning. I'm welcoming you back to my kitchen. Today we have again another simple recipe. I'm taking advantage of the fruits in season. And one of the fruits we have in season is plums. And from plums, we are making plum jam. And we only have two ingredients, the plums and a sweetener. To our ingredients, we have we have two ingredients only: a bowl of plums that is amounting to two cups of plums and jaggery. We need to put a ratio of one is to one, but here I'm putting two is to one in favor of the fruits. We have to dice the jaggery to powder and the fruits we have them here we have already um, washed them clean and diced them we have water here it's clean water all we need to do is to put this together add water enough to cover the ingredients in the pot and to bring it to a boil and once it has boiled you uncover and put it to a simmer for 30 to 45 minutes or until the water has reduced and the plums have become mushy. As you noticed, I did not dissolve this time the jaggery. I also did not remove the seeds from the dates. This we will do as we will be sieving in the end. So this simmered for close to an hour actually for me and here we had allowed it to cool. It simmered and I switched it off and allowed it to cool and now I want to sieve to extract the jam. Plums are a very rich source of iron and very many nutrients. I just love the red color. Um, and plus they're in season and they're so sweet. If you will get to the market, get the fresh ones, the nice looking ones, and have a bite and try this recipe. It's quite simple, does not need baking. Look at the amount of jam we've got. This amounted to one and a half cups. It looked like jelly jam. It reminded me of my high school life. I used to love the mixed fruit jam, which used to buy we would buy for breakfast bread. And pretty this is how it came out. It was sweet. Many recipes they do two cups of um, plums and two cups of the sweetener. But I decided to half it because I really fear too much sugar, too much sweetener. You can try yourself. You can try with basically any fruit, pineapples alone, mangoes, they're in season. And it will come out pretty well. I tried mine in my scones which I had baked some few days early and it was sweet. Remember when you eat, eat to the glory of God. Remember to be a sunshine, a channel of light wherever you are. Yeah, I'm glad that you've tuned in to our new subscribers. You're most welcome. I am glad that you're here. If you've not yet subscribed, please hit the subscribe button and you'll be the first person to receive the recipe. Until next time, see you. Bye. Enjoy.